night, guys. It is a beautiful moonlit winter night here in Doomsday Trailer uh, on this glorious. Uh, what is it? It is a Tuesday night, February twentieth, twenty four. So I'm I'm trying to figure out how I can bore the living shit out of Gloria Ninati. Uh, I I live to. To bore Gloria Ninati, uh, she told me she doesn't know which she would rather not listen to, Donald Trump or space aliens. So uh, I'm going to see if I can go one deeper, Gloria, and we're going to talk about the C word, the C word. But before we get into this broken record rant about the C word, just want to. <laughs> tell you about uh, finally unclogging the drain from hell today. The instant power heavy duty drain opener. We have the skull and crossbones, uh, the skull and crossbones poison uh, thing on the front. We uh, have the, the big orange exclamation point, all capital letters. Uh, y y y you know about how this shit can, can fucking explode in your face, uh, how it can burn your face off, how it can fucking blind you for life to, uh, y y you know, to, to, to put on these goddamn safety goggles. And, and these fucking uh, gloves up to here, and then you, and first you got to get it out of the fucking bag. For safe storage, use this bag to store unused container. Secure cap tightly. Keep locked up and out of reach of children. This bag is not completely leak proof. Yeah. <laughs> the 500 fucking ways uh, you, you can fucking kill yourself uh, well, with the fucking drain opener. Uh, the, the, you, you know, this, this is on the product. There's probably something on, on the fucking, my, my fucking bottle of tequila uh, letting me know, you know, uh, there's a lot of fucking drunks uh, out there, uh, that fucking alcohol can eat your goddamn brain. It can eat your fucking liver. Uh, you know, obviously, uh, thousands, millions of people getting in fucking wrecks every year for, for drinking fucking alcohol. You know, I've got the fucking drain opener in one hand. I've got the fucking alcohol in the other hand. You know, shut the fuck up! You know, with all of this goddamn fear mongering, every fucking thing you touch, you know, talk, oh god, you're gonna fucking die! You're gonna, you're gonna die! You're, you're gonna kill somebody! You're gonna have a margarita! You're gonna get in your truck! You're gonna have a wreck! You're gonna kill yourself! Or you're gonna kill somebody else! Or, or you're, or you're gonna fucking blind yourself. Uh, you're, you're, you're gonna goddamn poison your fucking dog when, when you when you change your radiator fluid. You're, you're, you're gonna kill your fucking dog. You know, Jesus fucking Christ. You little pussies, shut the fuck up. You know, I'm sick and tired of this planet of fucking pussies. You know, everything is going to fucking hurt me. It's going to fucking kill me. You know, why don't you little fucking pussies, why don't you fucking put a big fucking condom over you and, and, and I don't know, climb under the fucking couch. It's a dangerous fucking world out there, okay? You're going to fucking die. You know... Like, do I have any friends who aren't fucking pussies? Whose entire lives 
are, are, are not guided by fucking fear. Everything. We're fucked. Every one of us, we're fucked. We're gonna fucking die. Okay? You're gonna fucking die. Your fucking kid's gonna die. Your fucking dog is gonna fucking die. There's nothing I can do about it. You know? So if you're wondering what all this is about, th this is my, uh, my, my broken record uh, C-word rant that I've been having for four fucking years. Four years, and I have never moved the needle from day one since I ever heard the fucking word. It's another fucking wolf outside the cave door. Fucking learn to live with it and shut the fuck up. You know, so 99% so of us, just like I said, are, are, are going to get sick and tired uh, of this fucking shit and, and decide it's one more wolf outside of the fucking cave door. It's another fucking saber-toothed tiger. It's a fucking rattlesnake. It's a whatever. You know, we're, we're dealing with, with all these fucking wolves have been since we were fucking cavemen. You know, and, and, and then this one came along four years ago and all these fucking little pussies going into this fucking fear mode and, and, and dealing with all of these goddamn corona pussies. Uh, it's gonna fucking kill me! It's gonna fucking kill me! Yeah! <coughs> you know, I've been hearing this shit for four fucking years. And uh, at least 99% of the fucking people uh, have shut the fuck up about it. But, but some people who I have a lot of respect for uh, on every other subject are, are still going on and on and on about this shit. You know? Get the fuck over it. And, and then... Uh, you know, I've got the other side. Uh, you know, if my fucking friends are, aren't still fucking corona pussies after all these years, then, then I've got the fucking vaccine pussies. And they're just as bad. I, I have said from day one, and, and, and one more time, for the record, no, I have not gotten the fucking corona panic vaccine for the simple reason I have never seen one fucking iota of evidence that it is in my best interest to get the fucking vaccine. That's why I haven't gotten the fucking vaccine. If you want to read the fucking evidence, Think it's in your best evidence, in your best interest to get the fucking vaccine. You're a fucking adult. Get the fucking vaccine and shut the fuck up about it. You know, this fucking ship sailed four fucking years ago. Uh, everyone's made up their fucking minds uh, about this shit. And, and thank God, it looks like 99% of the fucking planet, just like I predicted on day fucking one, is moving on with their fucking lives. Uh, but, but, but these vaccine people, they're, 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 they're two peas out of the same pot. These fucking corona pussies, they're, 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 they're the same fucking pea pod as the vaccine pussies. I did not get the vaccine because not only have I yet to see one iota of evidence uh, that is in my best interest, but, uh, but I'm not scared of getting fucking corona panic. I used to call it a bad hair day. Well, I guess I have moved the fucking needle off of it because I did get fucking corona panic. It was a fucking joke. A fucking joke. It's not as bad as a bad hair day. You ever really had a fucking... I'm, I'm like, I'm having a fucking bad hair day today, man. 
uh, fucking uh, Corona, but good God, uh, this is it? Uh, you know? But I did not not get the vaccine because I'm scared uh, of the fucking side effects of the vaccine. If you're some little vaccine pussy, some fear-strangled fucking sheep uh, reading all of this bullshit, uh, it, 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 it's bullshit everywhere you fucking go. If you did not get the vaccine because you were uh, afraid of the side effects from the back from the vaccine you're every bit as much of a fucking pussy as the fucking corona pussies getting the vaccine because they think it's going to do a I don't know do they still uh, rip down your uh, videos uh, there, there's no fucking difference you're you're making a decision based out of fear uh, as fucking Don Juan was saying in 1960, any fucking decision you make out of fear is the wrong fucking decision. Uh, but, 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 but God damn it. Uh, I, I, I mean, and so many of these people, they, they don't seem to me uh, on, on, on all other subjects, all other fucking subjects, uh, they they don't seem to me uh, like they're fucking fear strangled pussies. But but on this one, uh, like what the fuck? Why, dude? Uh, why 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 the fuck is it this one? Y you know, and I don't even need to use any names here. Uh, <laughs> You know, the, 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 this is my buddy. Uh, you know, I I I I, I think we're, we're friends. I think our goddamn friendship is is strong enough uh, to 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 survive this pointless fucking debate between uh, between the the two of us. Uh, but but he but, but he he keeps on harping about it, and uh, so it was it wasn't. Uh, so much, uh, I, I don't read his fucking, uh, C-word rants. I, I, I don't even read them, uh, I I anymore because it's a broken fucking record, uh, j j just like this rant, but it was mainly a comment, uh, so he, he makes his rant, uh, without even, uh, reading his fucking rant, I, as I, I assume, uh, what you're talking about here. Uh, you know, but it was a comment to my comment. Uh, you, you, you know, so what you hear all the time uh, about how uh, if you're not fucking concerned about uh, fucking corona panic, that you're a fucking heartless bastard uh, that would run over your fucking grandmother or, or, or what the fuck ever. And, uh, you know, he's asking me, uh, he, he pulls some fucking number out of his ass, which is uh, any of these numbers, uh, each side is going to have their fucking number of the day. They pull out your fuck and their fucking asses. He pulls some number out of his fucking ass talking about how many fucking people does it take, Sam, uh, for, for you not to be a fucking heartless bastard uh, who would run over your grandmother? Uh, it, it, you know, and, and, and uh, something like, is, is, is 800 billion sick people not enough for you? And, and, and I just answered, uh, honestly, like 99% like of people. Obviously, no. I, I bet no, uh, it's not. And, and my buddy, his response back was, that was, you know, that was a tad harsh, Sam. But what, what I, uh, okay, ju just in case my buddy's listening to this or whoever this little corona pussy making this thing is, uh, you know, a asking me, uh, you know, what is it going to take uh, for you to feel sorry for people getting corona panic? Well, you, you know, I 
I, I have a, I, I, so, so my father died of heart disease. His father died of heart disease. I just had three hot dogs for dinner and, and I'm on my second goddamn drink and when I finish my second drink on top of my three hot dogs, I'm going to go get this damn tub of Tillamook brownie batter ice cream and sit here and stuff it in my fucking face. You know, what is it about fucking Corona Panic? Uh, I, you know, it's, there's heart disease, there's fucking stroke. Now, that is the one. If I had to pick the one medical condition that I am scared of, that I am is stroke. You know, having a fucking stroke and not having it kill me. Okay, I admit... That one fucking scares me more than any of them. Uh, if I get fucking cancer, uh, I, I want to I wanna discover it at stage six and, and be dead the next day. But, but, but why aren't these corona pussies? I've never seen this dude. I've been reading him for a couple of years. As far as I know, he's never written a fucking... Uh, article uh, about cancer. He's never written a fucking article uh, about heart disease. He, he's never uh, written a fucking article, uh, you know, about people getting killed in wrecks. As far as I know, this dude has a car. As far as I know, brother, you've got a fucking car. Every time you get in the fucking car, and I, and I think he's actually admitted this as much, uh, every time you get in a fucking car, you, you, you could either fucking hurt yourself, paralyze yourself, kill yourself, run a, you know, hit some kid on a bicycle. Uh, you are a fucking danger to yourself. You're, you're a fucking danger to anybody, uh, you know, in your path. Uh, you, you, could, uh, you could cause a fucking wreck. Uh, and, 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 and hurt somebody, you could fucking kill somebody, but, but, but you, I don't hear anybody guilt tripping me, uh, for riding around in my gas fucking truck, but because, uh, because I might fucking kill myself or some innocent person. You know, I've never read a fucking article that, that, that he's written uh, about driving around in a fucking car and killing fucking somebody. You know, uh, it, 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 it's, yeah, I, I, I mean, I, I, I put fucking Corona Panic uh, right out there with, with every other fucking wolf in, in, in the fucking door. Uh, I mean, outside of the fucking cave door. Fucking people fall off of fucking ladders every day. Fucking kill themselves. I was up on a fucking ladder today. I have almost killed myself three times with chainsaws. Three fucking times uh, I, I should have killed myself with fucking chainsaws. Uh, chainsaws, you kill yourself with those motherfuckers. I, I know two people who have been killed by other people using chainsaws. They didn't even they didn't even have a fucking chainsaw and some other motherfucker with a chainsaw. Kill them. Chainsaws kill people. Why do I I've almost killed my, my, my fucking self three times? I've probably almost killed the dog and a bunch of other uh, people, people with a chainsaw. What am I doing tomorrow? I'm getting out a fucking chainsaw and I don't even have my chaps. But but I'm but but I'm gonna get out there uh, with a fucking chainsaw uh, because uh, there's some fucking dead trees in my way uh, that, that I need to fucking cut down and I need a fucking chainsaw. If, if one of the fucking trees falls on me and kills me, that's the fucking uh, well. Live by the chainsaw, by die by the fucking chainsaw. You know, I'm just sick and fucking tired of pussies. And as I'm uh, reading, uh, I'm, I actually meant uh, I meant to read this a lot quicker. So I, uh, you know, so uh, this dude's uh, rant about the fucking c word uh, coming out yesterday, and, and I'm thinking, 
that thank God at least we're not hearing this shit in the fucking mainstream media. And then I open up the fucking mainstream media. Uh, and, uh, and, 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 and what the fuck do I see largest ever Corona panic vaccine study links shot to small increase in heart and brain conditions. No shit Sherlock. This study, I guess, they have, they, they've now tracked 99 million people, 99 million fucking people uh, who have gotten, uh, who, who have gotten uh, the, the damn uh, corona panic vaccine and no shit Sherlock, uh, a, a few people ha have reactions to vaccines. Uh, you know anybody uh, acting like there, there, there is no fucking chance uh, that, that that getting one of these vaccines could have a fucking side effect is every bit as fucking clueless as these anti-vaxxers. You know, talking about you know all, all of their their crazy uh, anti-vax shit. Uh, you're you're two fucking peas out of the same bunch. So this is a long fucking article breaking down all of these goddamn side effects, blah, 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 blah. But here is the bottom line with, with uh, one, of, one of these virologists they're talking about. Da-da! It always, it always comes down to a risk-benefit analysis of what you are more afraid of, the vaccine's side effects or the virus itself. And, and he's not even talking uh, about how he says there that, that every fucking vaccine ever invented for every fucking uh, virus, a few people are going to have fucking side effects and they're going to regret getting the goddamn thing, and then they would rather uh, have had the less the, than a bad hair day. But it always comes down to what you're more afraid of. Uh, that, 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 that's, the, that, that's the best bottom line I've ever read by this virologist. This no fucking shit, Sherlock. What are you more afraid of? Ah! 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 Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! We've got the virus, the pandemic on this side of oh God, but I'm gonna fucking need all this. Oh! Oh God! I'm so afraid. What am I gonna be more afraid of? Am I gonna be more afraid of, of the virus? Am I gonna be more afraid of, of the fucking shot? Shut the fuck up! You're a fucking pussy. You're a fear strangled fucking pussy. You live your fucking life in fear. You little pussy. I've got nothing but 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 fucking uh, n nothing but fucking pity for, for, for any of you. L living your fucking life in fear. You know, I was just listening. I found this. Uh, I, 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 I found uh, this rant that I did uh, before I went out to California for my soft white underbelly uh, interview and uh, thinking I'll sometimes mark one of his questions is what's your biggest fear? And uh, my biggest fear has nothing to do with the state of the planet. My biggest fear, and, and I'm just going to have to say it, uh, my biggest fear in my life a year and a half ago, was it a year and a half ago or, yeah, about a year and a half ago, my single biggest fear was that my, oh, my, my little red-haired succubus doomer chick for never was going to decide she did not want to be my doomer chick forever. That was my single biggest fear on the face of the planet. Well, it happened. 
my my little red-haired succubus is not going to be uh, my my doomer chick forever. So I faced my single biggest fear uh, of my entire life. And so now that one's just become uh, fear, uh, well, not even fear, there's no doubt, fear implies doubt, that I am never going to have a fucking woman in my life again. It's never going to fucking happen for me. Never again, as long as I damn live, a a a am I going to get in a relationship with a woman. And, uh, and right up there with that fear is, is the fear of my dog dying uh, before I do. Which, uh, you know, which is right up there with stroke. It's the, it's the fear of loneliness. It's the fear uh, uh, of being a, an old man with broken teeth stranded without love. Uh, it, 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 you, you know? I, I, I just really, I, 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 I just, I, I just get so, uh, just so, I, I, I don't know, just triggered. I, I am so fucking triggered by, by people who, who live their lives in fucking fear. Uh, about what the fuck is going to kill them or this. Oh, shut up. But anyway, Gloria, was that better for you? Did you enjoy that one better, Gloria? So now that I've gotten that off, uh, I'm going to have to come back this, uh, this human-hating alien experiencer, I have to come back with my review of Resident Alien on Netflix coming right up. Bye guys. What are you afraid of? You have got Lyme's disease. You have Lyme's disease and you have another tick-borne uh, illness right now in your body, Sancho. I pulled 50 ticks off of me last summer. 50 ticks off of me. I probably have Lyme's disease. I probably have three fucking deadly tick-borne viruses in my body right now. And I don't give a fuck. Here's the log. What do you think? I'm just ready for some chicken. Fly down. What are you afraid of? I'm afraid I might not ever see a chicken again.